FSO backstage, Kendra G with the one and only. I'm going to call her Miss 117,000 copies in the first week. Yes, honey. I like that. I like that. I like that, too. Tamar Braxton. How are you? Okay, last time I saw you, I had a bob. I said, uh-uh, I'm going to get my weave back. Because, right. look, she was so fabulous. I got to put the hair back in, child. <laughs> I want to talk about redemption because I feel like I, I introduced you in, in saying your first week album sells because I think it was like a smack in everybody's face who didn't necessarily believe in you in that way. So now that, you know, you have this big champion album week sells, how does it feel? It feels amazing. I mean, it's not even really about the numbers. It's really about the opportunity. Right. Because it's really all about singing and sharing my gift. At the end of the day, so all the other stuff is just like the cherry on top. Yes, but I know the numbers matter because you told me that you Ike and Tina with your husband Vince, and he don't play no games. Get set him on um, records in a May. You know, he just wants me to put my best foot forward. Right, you know, right. I never expected that number. I never expected you know having the number two album in the country and then have my album considered as pop. Like I'm right. not a pop artist anymore. Right. But on a serious note, your album is really good. And I'm not just saying that from my perspective, my cousin who has been playing it nonstop. People are really feeling the album. So that feels good, too. I'm quite sure. And it was purposely done. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it was purposely done because yeah. I never thought I would get this opportunity again. Okay. So I looked at it as if it was like my last meal right. in my life. So I was just like, okay, I have to love every single record that's on here. And it spoke to me and it spoke to my relationship. And so therefore, I guess it speaks to everybody else because it's nothing but the truth. Yes. Yeah, so you're going to be hitting the stage tonight. And there are so many girls who are waiting for you to go on stage. It's so yes, much I'm love for you. i about my Atlanta <laughs> Tamar and friends. That's you right. Are. Let's talk about, okay, Tamar and Vince is back on television. Yes. you got a lot of things going on. I do. I do. Yeah. What are you doing holding that? <laughs> how do you keep it? How do you, when do you sleep? Um, I sleep. You Actually, do? When? Yeah, at night. <laughs> Do you go to bed early? No. Does the baby keep you up house? No, I'm not going to say nothing. My okay. son is nothing like me. So he's not dramatic. He's real laid back. He's just like this. He's real cool, calm, collected. Just, are you so nice too. Are you serious? So serious. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, and, and you named him LV. LV. Louis Vuitton. Well, everybody needs a designer baby. <laughs> A designer baby. Oh, my goodness. So, and you told me last time, I want to know if your mind has changed. Any more kids? No, no. No? No. How'd you lose the weight so fast? Stop eating. What do you mean? Come on. You ate. You had to eat. Food food was my boyfriend when I was pregnant. So, like, I had to stop. (laughs) Tamar, you are hilarious. That is not true. I swear. Are you kidding me? You're not working out. Well, no, because my uterus just got back in place. Your uterus, it was out of place? So, <laughs> it kind of scared me, like, childbirth like that. That was my first experience, okay. like, really looking at it. Mm-hmm. And, you know, when Dr. Jackie was, trying, was putting me back together again, it's like, everything was on the table. <laughs> so, it scared me. I'm like, girl, I ain't jumping, running, hopping, skipping, nothing. <laughs> I love it. Well, you know, I'm not going to hold you too long because you have to hit the stage because there's thousands of people outside that have been waiting for you all day long. And you better just do it, girl. Oh I like the blondes. Yeah. <laughs> The one and only Tavon Braxton. Love it more in stores right now. FSO Backstage.